Hello and welcome to this Dr Ross Maths key skill video on division with a mixture of positive and negative numbers. Now the only rules that we need to know is that when we divide a negative number by a positive number then if you have a mixture of positive and negative where they're different signs then you end up with negative. If you divide a positive number by a negative number again because you've got a mixture of positive and negative you end up with negative. But if you divide a negative number by a negative number, then you end up with positive. And it's exactly the same with multiplication. If one of them is a positive number and the other negative, as in these two cases, you end up with negative. But if they're both negative, then you end up with a positive number. Exactly the same as multiplication. So without further ado, let's do these three examples. Minus 16 divided by 8. Well, let's worry about the sign first. And by sign, I mean whether it's positive or negative. Well, we've got negative divided by positive. Well, we've got a mixture of positive and negative in some order. And so we know the number is going to be negative. And then we can work out what the number is. So forgetting the sign, what is 16 divided by 8? Well, it's just 2. So we end up with minus 2. The second one, 15 divided by minus 3. Well, let's first worry about the sign. Well, we've got a mixture of positive and negative. So we know from here it's going to be a negative number, so let's put the minus. And then forgetting that sign, we're just going to do 15 divided by 3. 15 divided by 3 is 5, so it's minus 5. And then finally this, we've got minus 20 divided by minus 5. Well, they're both negative this time, and therefore we end up with a positive number. So it's going to be positive, and you don't need to put that plus. And let's forget the signs now. What is 20 divided by 5? Well, it's 4. So minus 20 divided by minus 5 is positive 4. And as I said, that plus is not necessary.